What is transhumanism? Transhumanism refers to a philosophical and scientific movement that advocates the use of current and emerging technologies, such as genetic engineering, cryonics, artificial intelligence, or AI and nanotechnology to augment human capabilities and improve the human condition. Thus, the transhumanists envision a future in which the responsible application of such technologies enables humans to slow, reverse, or eliminate the aging process, to achieve corresponding increases in human life spans, and to enhance human cognitive and sensory capacities. The movement proposes that humans with augmented capabilities will evolve into an enhanced species that transcends humanity, indeed, the post-human condition. The term transhumanism was popularized by the English biologist and philosopher Julian Huxley in his 1957 essay of the same name. Huxley held that it was now possible for social institutions to supplant human evolution in refining and improving the human species. Although Huxley was principally concerned with advancing the human condition through social and cultural change, the general notion of humanity transcending itself came to be adopted by the emerging transhumanist movement, which coalesced around significant scientific advances, such as the development of computer technology, the advent of space travel, and the successful use of cryopreservation, for example, of human eggs and embryos. In the 1980s, newly formed transhumanist organizations and schools of thought advocated human life extension, cryonics, space colonization, and futurism, that is, the study of current trends in order to anticipate, plan for, and influence their possible outcomes. In 1986, the American engineer, K. Eric Drexler published Engines of Creation, an exploration of the future applications of nanotechnology and molecular manufacturing. In addition, he and the American researcher Christine L. Peterson founded the Foresight Institute to promote the safe implementation of nanotechnology and bioengineering. Also in the 1980s, the American conceptual artist, Natasha Vitamore, published an evolving manifesto of transhumanism and the transhumanist art statement, which announced the designing of a future that merged aesthetics with science and technology to enhance sensory experiences and to improve and extend human life. Other prominent voices within the transhumanist movement were the American philosopher James Hughes and the Austrian-born Canadian roboticist Hans Moravec. In the 1990s, extropianism, a libertarian doctrine that advocates overcoming human limitations through technology, came to the forefront of the transhumanist movement. The British philosopher Max Moore founded the Extropy Institute early in the decade with the American philosopher and lawyer Tom W. Bell, who used the term extropy to designate a concept oppositional to entropy, highlighting the movement's individualistic proactive approach to expanding human potential. In 1998 the Swedish philosopher Nick Bostrom and the British philosopher David Pearce founded the World Transhumanist Association, an international organisation that promoted transhumanism as a serious academic discipline. The WTA rebranded itself as Humanity Plus in 2008 to project a more diverse and cohesive vision of transhumanism, one that included branches of thought from both the Extropy Institute, which closed in 2006, and the WTA and advocated the safe and ethical use of technology to expand human capabilities. It is interesting to note that transhumanism found further support from Silicon Valley entrepreneurs, including Google co-founder Larry Page, Amazon's Jeff Bezos, and Tesla's Elon Musk. In fact, in 2013 Page launched Calico Life Sciences LLC, a research and development company dedicated to extending the human lifespan through advanced technologies. In early 2022, Bezos and other backers invested $3 billion in Altos Labs, a biotechnology company seeking to reverse aging and disease. Musk founded SpaceX in 2002 in hopes of establishing human colonies on the Moon and Mars 
and launched Neuralink in 2016 to develop implantable brain chips. In July 2022 the brain chip company Synchron announced that it had successfully implanted a chip in the brain of an amyotrophic lateral sclerosis, or OLS, patient in the United States. The chip was designed to enable severely paralyzed patients to operate digital forms of communication with their thoughts.